Um, Robert Zemeckis says that there is a good Roger Rabbit 2 script that will never get made because of Jessica Rabbit, Robert Zemeckis demonizing women. Uh, no, I'm sorry, not to misquote Robert Zemeckis. <laughs> He's going to be watching this uh, podcast. No, on the Happy, Sad, Confused podcast. No, I love you, Robert Zemeckis. And Who Framed Roger Rabbit is one of my favorite movies. He literally has it on VHS. Somewhere. Yeah, I have uh, two times. One of them signed by um, Charles Fleischer himself, by the way, which we have an interview that is in the can <laughs> with him. But he says that there's a good script sitting at Disney. Here's the thing. Here's what you have to know. Know that the current Disney would never make Roger Rabbit today. Um, they can't make a movie with, with Jessica in it. If you have been to Disneyland and gone to the Roger Rabbit cartoon spin, you would see that she is now covered up with a nice yellow French coat. I, she is. <laughs> what? Sorry, I just want to apologize because when I switched the camera to me, it was that scene. <laughs> with the... Yeah, with the whole... <laughs> <laughs> with the whole the glory hall yeah i <laughs> the glory i literally hall. like switched it to me to like make a comment i looked was on the screen I was like ah nobody's yeah. paying attention to that it's just a crtv in the background Ooh. that's what you think uh, <laughs> everybody's gonna just pause that one scene i'll say that i'm actually you know whatever about uh, the rob rabbit the, 2 yeah i'm i'm well we have rob rabbit 2 it's called um, Rescue Rangers with Andy Samberg. It's yeah. so that is movie is so good. But I will say that if they made a Roger Rabbit two, I would not be on board. It like I wouldn't. A thousand percent agree with you on that. And that thousand. I'd, I'd be comment. like, mm, I. You guys know how I feel about Beetlejuice. <laughs> <laughs> if they made Roger Rabbit, I love that movie with all my heart, and there's no way. And they said they have a good script. Prove it. I, I don't it. believe you. Don't do it don't unless it's perfect. Don't yeah. do it unless it's perfect. There's no Leak way. The script. <laughs> no, that, Leak the script. That's you but know no, what? They, there's no way that they could do it because um oh my god. Because the leak like the legalities like they had Bugs Bunny. Well, Mickey you heard Mouse. about also so many people have died that that were like the heart of that movie. Yeah, and you're that, talking about Bob Hoskins. That the, Bob that Hoskins. movie was groundbreaking, and it even created terminology of bumping the light because of like mm -hmm. the detail that they put into that film. It is a perfect movie. In my opinion, I do not need to see anything else. Roger Rabbit related ever again. Never don't touch that masterpiece. Bob Zemeckis. I don't give a shit how good of a filmmaker you are. I just, just leave it, leave it. It's perfect. Leave it alone. I, I'll tell you though, if they want to do something, I would love to read that script and perfect place to talk about it. Then make it into a comic. Give me a comic book. Dude, Truly. That, that's what they did with Fight Club. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Give me a comic book. I'll or be also, more than happy. they used to do like little, like short, um, animated, like actual Roger Rabbit cartoons. Cartoons. And it made it like before um, Honey I Trunk of the Kids. Do Honey... But do you remember them? I. <laughs> but do you like remember them like you remember Roger Rabbit? Uh, yes, I do. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, yes, I do. Because I, <laughs> I, yeah. Because I would rep <laughs> because <laughs> you don't even start with me, bro. Because they put one before Honey I Shook the Kids, and I remember I would put it in uh, and I would start and I would watch until that point. And I'm like, I don't want to watch Honey I Shook the Kids. I'd take it out. You don't want to watch Honey I Shook the Kids. I do because you guys know that I love that movie, but I'm just saying that I would watch it. Strictly, sometimes I'm just like I want to watch just that. The Roger Rabbit. Cartoon. I want to watch a. It was one where they went like camping or something or other, right? No, it was a one where he is getting all the wait. <laughs> there was a there was like a few. I, There's I don't a few remember and any a different, of them. All sorts of movies, and we have to go Easter hunting for them. I will, I will at some point. There's a picture of maybe like seven or eight year old me at Disney at the time. It was Disney's MGM Studios. Oh, and there was a Jessica Rabbit cutout photo op thing. I'm and, sure there was. And I was a young lass, straight up, hand around the hip. Yep, I got it. <laughs> around the hip. Around the hip, just, just like as far as he could reach. <laughs> wow. I I don't. I, at the time, I didn't realize why I loved that character so much. But I loved that character. I like. I, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess I knew, but you know, you know what I'm saying. You're not at that. Can I tell you something? And okay, so <laughs> <laughs> um, this is the I I think this is the test of a bisexual. Okay, if you watch Roger Rabbit and you're like, man, 
I love Roger Rabbit. That guy, I love Roger Rabbit. And then you also have a crush on Roger Rabbit and you also have a crush on Jessica. You're bisexual. If you look, people had a crush on Roger Rabbit. <laughs> I was going to say, wait, what? You Don't even alone, fucking man. play with me right now. <laughs> I had a crush on Roger Rabbit. You're joking. <laughs> he. I thought you had a crush on the fox from Robin Hood. I did. Uh, I yeah. had multiple yeah. crushes. It's fine. <laughs> was like, they yeah. could be oh, yeah. animals. It's fine. I was young. I was figuring it out. I. Anthropomorphic crushes. We're gonna have to go through Spirit that. The horse. What? what? Spirit what? the horse. That guy was a stud. I'm she serious. She was like he was a stallion. Uh, he was a stallion. <laughs> you guys, I'm sorry. I'm talking the wrong crap. I'm talking the wrong. Roger Rabbit, though. Uh. I know. <laughs> it's an, it, it has informed my taste for men. So your expectations like Roger Rabbit are higher. <laughs> Roger Rabbit? No. <laughs> no. Uncle Mark, Are Roger you joking? <laughs> Goofy and silly and cute and loves it's been his lady. It's so long since I've seen this movie. Like, Watch it again and tell me that you don't have a crush on Roger Rabbit. Let Jeff look at the right now. Watch it again and tell me you don't have a crush on Roger Rabbit. Look at Rabbit. For real. Look at Roger Rabbit pulled up. It's not doing it for you? I'm saying watch it and tell me that the way he acts... All right, I will watch it this week and next week for the podcast. Let I me will know. Report back. Sorry, hey. Diddy, it's a no for me. Seriously, <laughs> don't look at the picture. It is the way he acts. It's his He's personality. Like and silly. You know that TikTok trend where people like do is... the like hear me out cakes. Yeah. I, that's that's hey, that's Diddy. Hear me out, Roger Rabbit. <laughs> that's all out, I gotta say. No. I no. <laughs> I want to do. I want I bet to do you didn't this know now. that. No. That's where this was going. Please. No. <laughs> Any anthropomorphic cartoon crushes that you have out there, let us know in the <laughs> in the chat. What's, what's the sequel to Lion King? Uh, oh. Pride. Oh, the yeah. Mohawk Co Lion. Co yes. Kovu. Kovu. We didn't What's tease the child. The goth teenage lion. <laughs> Desperately need to move on. Goth <laughs> teenage <laughs> lion? Okay. Hello. Move on. 100%. Anyway. 100%. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Hear me out. Iron Giant. <laughs> Iron Giant? <laughs> what? <laughs> he was so gentle and loving. He's so caring. The, I He's so caring. Yeah. Oh my god. He's so pure. I feel like you guys are per wait, like wait, wait. you <laughs> guys are you know, this, this is crush. I don't it's know. Not necessarily we got like comics to talk sexual. about. It sounds sexual. I was gonna talk okay. about my week. Okay. okay. All right. Just I before we move on, one more thing. So fuck you guys Mary don't get kill. it. The giant Roger Rabbit, the fox. No, we're moving on. Uh, next minute, I do it. I, I, I answer those questions for sure. Yeah, no, I've got an answer. I'm gonna avoid. It. Maybe we should. I'm gonna help you guys out not answering those questions. Let's Maybe move on to. We do this next week, please. Next week, we'll all we'll all have a hear me out. Oh my you guys God. watch Robert Ra watch Rabbit. Watch you guys tell watch a wabbit. You guys watch wabbit, watch season. wabbit and it's you tell me. Season. She said it's wabbit season. You <laughs> Ty uh that might be the funniest fucking thing we've ever That's said. That's the ever funniest ever. fucking thing that right, you've ever That's said. All I got. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. CNN News uh, Entertainment <laughs> reporting. Colin Farrell shared a few texts back and forth with Danny DeVito, who is best? Uh, who is the best penguin ahead of his reprising role? Mm. So mm. apparently, since they worked on Dumbo together with Tim Burton, uh, uh, Tim Burton's love of Danny DeVito, which. Uh, Dumbo. You know what? I didn't like it initially, but I, I like it. I like Dumbo. Michael Keaton's in it, Danny DeVito's in it, Colin Farrell's in it. Um, it's a it's it's a fantastic little film, actually. I'm it's it, it's nothing like the original Dumbo, obviously, well, but yeah, probably in some ways that's good. Yeah, some that's, good. <laughs> yeah. Line, that's good. But it is a very sweet film, and I actually um feel like it's one of Tim Burton's better, more recent films, but mm. I just it didn't get a lot of love because it wasn't Dumbo. However, I don't know if you guys have been keeping up with the Penguin HBO. I, I have not actually. watched a single watch. episode. No? It looks good. But what's that girl's Anybody name that it? she's in uh, How I Met Your Mother? She's like yeah, that's, the mother? Uh, she's telling that's what we were talking about today. Um, she was in another movie with um, the guy that plays Nick from Christine 
Um, Meloti? Meloti? She's in a she movie with Jake Falcone. Johnson. She's in, in a movie with Jake Johnson. Yeah. She's also in a few episodes of Mythic Quest. Oh. Yeah, she is. Yeah. Yes, she is. That's my Dark Quiet Death. Yeah. She is putting on a fucking clinic on this show. She is so good on this show. This is the only non-Batman show. Like, I didn't realize I was going to love this show that much. Yeah. It is so good. And people are comparing it. really good. Oh, my gosh. Because... I was always like the Colin Farrell thing. Like you can find anybody else. Why like why all this makeup on Colin Farrell? But his performance is well, fantastic. He's, he's amazing. amazing. And, and uh, Matt Chris Reeves can, did this too. Yeah, Matt Reeves produced it. Um, the whole show is so good. I can't recommend it enough. I mean, at some point, if you know, obviously I've given Diddy enough stuff to binge watch. Um, but yeah, Kristen. Um, I'm dang it. I'm, I'm in, Miloti. How do I say that? M I L I O T I. PJ. Only seen her in. That's how I'd say it. Meloti? Melotai? Hey, put her in a Roger Rabbit elf. <laughs> <laughs> Not even Jessica Rabbit. You're like, put Roger Rabbit. That was so <laughs> Just put her in the Roger Rabbit. Look. Dude, honestly, sooner Bugs Bunny than Roger Rabbit. I agree. Did you guys think Bugs Bunny was attractive yes. when he dressed up as a girl bunny? <laughs> yeah. I like the height the heels give me. Yeah. I love that line that he says. He and Dad Bugs say Bunny, that. we have to move on. <laughs> uh, no, I, 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 I fear I'm coming off as a crazy person. But uh, the reason you're just a furry, it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> there's a there's a section for I'm that at Comic Con. Absolutely not. <laughs> uh, hey, we, we welcome we, we, the furry we, community. We're fans here. We want to know if your face is covered. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We wouldn't. Know. I'm just saying. I'm just talking about my formative years as a. Teenagers. <laughs> Crushes that, can be innocent, by the way. Exactly. You're not so sexual. It's very innocent. <laughs> <laughs> I, I agree. No, I agree. I mean, I mean, I agree. They can be. They're very innocent when you're a kid. You just you're attracted to something you don't know what it is, but it is personality things. Oh, thank you. You're right. You're right, Allison. Thank you, you Allison. Sorry, you're welcome. everyone. That's why I'm here. <laughs> yes. But, but, hey. Hey. <laughs> But, I wanted to pause, but okay. Yeah. Um, no. <laughs> pretty, pretty, pretty. pretty. <laughs> you just gave away that there's a cane applause now. No, <laughs> it's real. It's real. I you the were cheering. They were cheering. I turned the like clap on and off again. Um, yeah. The yeah. real question is, were you guys ever attracted to Danny DeVito when he played <laughs> the penguin? Because he's going to show you his French flipper trick. Who was <laughs> it? Who was it? Thank you. 